In this video I'll be changing the stem on my 2011 Giant XR2 Rome from the standard 110mm stem, that's centre to centre, for this 70mm stem. Now this one's got a rise and fall of 8 degrees, which means that if you have it that way round, it would have a fall of 8 degrees relative to the steerer tube, and if you have it this way round, it will have a rise of 8 degrees relative to the steerer tube. Remove this top cap. And then I need to undo the clamp bolts on this stem. And the same with the side. Once those are loosened, that should off. You can see this compression nut inside. It looks a bit like a star washer and it's fixed into the steerer tube. Now when you have the stem on and then you use this cap with the allen key on the top, its job is to fix into there and then draw up the steerer tube to take out the play in the bearings. I've just wiped this steerer tube, got some grease off it and just make sure it's clean. Now I'm ready to put the new stem on. First I need to put these spacers on. Now the stem I'm putting on is almost identical to the uh, one I took off uh, stack height wise so there shouldn't be any problem but if you're putting a new stem on you just have to make sure that the stack height is correct so you have a gap between the top of the steerer tube and the top of the stem. Now this particular unit has a sleeve to enable me to use this oversized stem and then I can slip that on. Now I do have that clearance I was talking about so I'm now ready to put the top cap on. That just goes into the compression nut and you tighten that up. That's a, a different size to my old one. That's a four millimeter. Now you need to tighten this to set the preload on the bearings. So as I was saying before, as you tighten this, it'll draw up the steerer tube and it'll load the bearings. Now you don't want it too tight, you don't want it too slack. You need to just sort of do it by trial and error and get it so it's the right sort of feel. Once you've set that, then you can tighten up the stem bolts. That'll hold the whole assembly together. A finished job.